the garment district. Over. Captain Watanabe gave me her cell number when she finally decided to trust me. She's risking a lot. If anyone finds out she's helping me, she'll lose her job. Attention all units. We have a possible kidnapping. Please mobilize toward Flatiron. Over. You might have heard about the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Horrible, demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider-Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider-Man stopped those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like prejudice. Wrong! Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone before you know anything about them. I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention to feed his gigantic, insatiable ego. Now, if I'm a mentally unstable person, and I see him getting all this coverage, what am I going to do? It's called copycat behavior, people, and it's ruining New York.
Oscorp visitor badge from when I interviewed there. Would have paid well, but Dr. Octavius offered the chance to really make a difference. Seriously? Give it up! You're never gonna catch me! That's what you said last time! Lose him. Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. 
I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice! Still enough. Can't lose him. Zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that map. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah, I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah, whenever, whatever. So I guess we're talking again. Cool. This will help me balance work and a personal life, if I ever find time to read it. I have to once again defend myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, a.k.a. The Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, 
I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sentence at the raft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package J. Jonah Jameson refuses. Lunatics will kill someone driving like that. We're free, We don't recognize your authority. Your vehicle is unregistered. You have to take him out. Okay, you are not getting five stars. Spider-Man car tour of New York. My suit's onboard AI can tell me the most likely area where the victim is. Tune my earpiece to listen for sounds of someone struggling. Piece picked up. You're safe now. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Spider Man. And there they are. Get him, Spidey. Spidey, hey, um. Screw it up, 
my meal ticket, Spider-Man! I did not sign up for this! All done. Thank you. Kind of weird anyone still kidnaps in the digital era. Seems like there'd be cybernapping or something. As I warned, Nostradamus like. After Spider-Man recklessly took down Wilson Fisk without preparing for the consequences, our streets are now filled with aspiring gangsters, each trying to out-psycho the other. My next guest is lucky to have survived an armed robbery. Sir, we're glad you're okay. Thanks. It was nuts. These dudes walk in like they own the place, waving guns around. Appalling. When a businessman is afraid to make an honest living. Yeah, it was a lifesaver that Spider-Man came along and stopped him. Weren't you listening? He caused the problem! I didn't... Forgive me for raising my voice. I'm emotional at the thought of what you went through. Jared, our caller seems shaken. Let's let him go. I'm fine. Goodbye! Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Peter, what can I do for you? Uh, sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? Uh, I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? Uh, I don't know. Why 
I take the risk? Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Partnership with restaurants and grocery stores works great. Any surplus food comes right here. Six months sober. Never thought I'd make it. You guys holding up all right? This moron thinks I'm going to move in with my daughter. Hey, that'd be great. She hasn't asked, but she's not gonna. I'm not going anywhere. You don't know that. Nobody does. Well, I'm not going anywhere. That's a promise. Hey, kid. How's all the science stuff going? Not bad, thanks. Witnesses reported even more explosions and a barrage of gunfire coming from inside the building after Spider-Man and the NYPD had moved in, which lasted much longer than police had hoped. However, once things quieted down, it wasn't long before Fisk himself was seen being escorted uh, out of I could write these. Handcuffed and in custody. This marks a big win for police and the first major this world coming to? Fisk. That cute social worker was here again today. You want to meet her, you let me know. Got some time to kill before Doc... Needs me at the lab. Let's do a little Spidey work out in the city. Never take a day off. Oh, it is on. again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. I'm just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was young. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter.
Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I, I didn't forget, forget, I just... I, I'll be there soon. <sighs> this tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. <sighs> He's right. How did I lose track of time? Oh, a toy designer made this prototype to get me to license my likeness. Too bad there's no way to get paid without revealing my identity. goes away and suddenly it's amateur hour. I bet you'll be as good at breaking out as you were at breaking in.
report of an assault in progress. Nearby officers, please proceed to the West Village. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes! <laughs> hey! Hey! What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work. In a secure environment. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. They, they, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. do something to help Doc. Call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. We should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. message about these before you left for you. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. 
As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is too. Well, it's not gonna pay the bills, but it sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. I've got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the, oh, what's the word, contaminants before they reach toxic levels. Between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might show they're polluting. The amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high and rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. Particles are concentrating in trouble spots, like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get samples, then trace them to the source. Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. these clouds to be visible to the naked eye, the level of toxins must be up there. And gotcha! I'm getting some good stuff. Well, good samples of bad stuff anyway. Got it. I must be freaking these people out. Ah, what else is new? Huh. The toxin's coming from two types of cars, and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos.
great light on that one. Perfect. Smokestack picture I ever took. The Department of Environmental Protection will take it from here. I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Well, Harry Station just stopped a public health crisis. Oscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Spider-Man, Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was, but one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. Hey, we don't need you here right now, right? Copy that. Thanks for the heads up. Got an 11:65 on the eastbound side of the Manhattan Bridge at the Flatbush Avenue exit. Sea services is in route. When spider cops on the job, come hell or high water, the job gets... Nope, nope, nope. Nope. She'd never admit it, but the chief was warming up to spider cop. His casual disregard for by-the-book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around. Someday. I created by putting Fisk away. Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. But what were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. The city, Norman actually, pulled our funding. Oh, Pete. I'm sorry. If Harry were here, he could talk some sense into his dad. You'll find another source. Your work's too important. Thanks, MJ. Talk to you soon. Herman! Long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but, uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? 
How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa, your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid? You just stupid! You talk so much! Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio of talking versus not talking? Also, how would you measure it? Words per minute, syllables per second? Or is it more about how many words one uses to express a single thought? It's also subjective. If you ask me, some people don't talk enough. Think about who their mysterious overlord is. The person they're working for, that kind of thing. Coming your way. Okay, now I can do some real damage. Because if I don't, they'll kill me! Me so young and stupid, you just stupid. You talk so much. Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? And who determines the ideal ratio of talking versus not talking? Also, how would you measure it? Words per minute? Okay, now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Because of my soul. Don't kill me! This one's gonna hurt. You come clean, I can help you! You really want to help me? Don't let me have the money! Sorry, not gonna happen. anymore. You're lucky you found actual cash. If you really want to rob banks, try day trade. It's all the rage. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. oh, come on, Herman. You tell me who you're working for. I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead. They made that very clear.
you tell me who you're working for. I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead. They made that very clear. on yourself literally He was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. I'm not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on demon uh, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. Fight with Shocker took a while. Time to catch up on what I've been missing out in the city. Doc left a message. Peter, I might have been a bit hasty advising you to find another job. I have a plan. Give me a bit of time. We may yet live to invent another day. The indomitable Otto Octavius. That's great news. Hope his plan works.
Hey, so I looked into reports of demons. I knew you'd come around. They've been pretty busy tonight, hitting a lot of Fisk properties. They're going after Fisk? Damn. You thinking what I'm thinking? Brewing gang war? Let's try to get ahead of it. Are there any Fisk properties that haven't been hit tonight? Let me see. Patrol reported a bunch of activity at one of his shipyards in Portside. Thanks, Yuri. I'll check it out. Hey, Yuri. Any idea what Fisk uses that shipyard for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. Rodrigo. He's really nervous. That woman doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? If that picture gets out, my life's over. Bad angle. Need to get it straight off. Sounds bigger than I. Th Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look. Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look familiar? I've never seen her. What were they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist, but I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. I'm losing him! Another victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No purchase with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line.
Another victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line. Another victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line. Sorry, I'm back now. Headed to that shipyard. Any intel on what Fisk uses it for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. His name's Jefferson Davis. That's his beat. He's a good cop. Been working the Fisk case for years. If anyone knows what's going on at that shipyard, it's him. Jobs for the demons. These guys are serious. Do they just want to replace Fisk? That'd be bad enough. Hope it's not something worse.
Your car is under duress. You need immediate response. Any officers near Hell's Tax, please copy. Heart to heart time. Were you not loved enough as demon babies? Dad to withholding? Mom not around? Let us cry all night? Gearing up for something big. Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup, but that don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check. Eagle 2, you up? Eagle 2 reporting in. Eyes on. What caches are the demons after? Need to take out Fisk's men and figure out what they're guarding. Whatever it is, I don't want it in Fisk's or the demon's hands. Snipers everywhere. Might need to deal with them first. Who's this? A lot of junk scattered around here. A well-placed web shot could make a great distraction. <laughs> You're dead now. Who's there? Snipers everywhere. Might need to deal with them first. Junk scattered around here. A well placed web shot could make a great distraction. More or less. Now let me focus. Trying to make sure we didn't miss anything. They keep talking about gear. What does Fisk store here?
us had this place for? Looks ancient. Only a decade or two. Been through a dozen different owners before him. Dope smugglers in the 80s, police runners back in the day. Now we've got our gear in the vault. See you part of the grand crime tradition. Jump in. You too. Scatter. Shipyards like a minefield. Booby traps from every decade all over the place. What's the point of that? Can't someone disarm them? Too many. Some are too old. Besides. You know this old bootlegger tunnel isn't gonna seal itself. You wanna help me out here? Seems like you've got it. Besides, I'm on watch. On watch. Great attitude, kid. Gonna take you real far. It's done pretty well for me. Z-23, CR-17, and D-12. CR-20. Crap, I don't have numbers, just names. Shaped charges, detonator caps, blasting gel. That sniper has a guard watching him. What do you need to divide and conquer? You two finished the survey yet? Don't worry. Frank, fall asleep on us? Frank? Oh crap. Hey, someone check on him. Heading over to And I lost him. You can't Good job, Spidey. Forever.
You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Any place this rundown should have a hole in the wall or a broken window. Check around back. I'd go myself, but you know, not Spider-Man. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Hello? Any fishermen with a grudge and a hook for a hand? Okay, where's that locked door? Jeff, you there? I'm doing my best to refrain from knock-knock jokes. Appreciate it. You see a junction box powering the door? Yeah, got it. If we can overload it, that should force the door open. Smart, but I don't have anything that packs enough current. Try this. Stun gun, genius! Capacitors in this are just what I need for an upgrade I've been thinking of. Gadget man, huh? You remind me of my son. He started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Those guys love their hidden rooms. Check it out. Sound hollow to you? I got a hidden panel, like the one on the door. The conduits lead out the back. Look for another junction box. Let's see if my mask lenses can pick up the conduits. that work? Nah. Must not be the right box. Keep looking. Thanks. Hopefully I 
I could have unlocked this myself. Hey, I doubt I would have found it without you. Hmm. We got a big fat nothing. Well, there's one secret room that could be more. Notice anything about the floor? Aha. Uh -huh. They can hide the doors, but not the scrapes they leave. Keep an eye out for more of those. Found a scrape. Oh, I guess normal doors don't count, huh? Good guess. Pay dirt. Scrape, no door. None I can see anyway. Great. Be right there. Maybe not. Elevator's busted. Sit tight. I'll pull you up. I could use a little help with the elevator. Right, I'm on it. Did you figure out how to get this elevator working? Not yet. Working on it. Floor, rusted machine parts, big honking rats. <laughs> Careful, the bridge is out. I got this one. <sighs> nice, stuck the landing and everything. We're not all donut eaters. <laughs> Fair enough. <clears throat> Another secret door. I'll rig the lock. Let me know if you find the junction box. Yep, on it. Did it open? No. This door must be hooked for another box. You were after this for a long time, huh? He's my great white whale. Ha <laughs> ha! Found one! Nailed it! Hell yeah, you did. Hey, check this out. Nothing. I'm starting to feel like this is Fisk's way of messing with me. Well, look at the walls. They kept guns here. They wouldn't have moved them to the front door. Gotta be a passageway we're missing. Check out the wall. This might control access to another area. Fisk's men were talking about a vault. Maybe we're close. Bet on it. Looks like a dual circuit. See if you can find a second junction box. Found it. Clear. You were right, Jeff. 
Trap door. Outstanding. Think you can help me out? This thing's heavy. One, two, three. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. I can't get through. Let me see how it looks from the top. Got room to maneuver here. Hang on. I'm blocked. Anything you can do? What was that? Subway, maybe. Let's hustle. Place is unstable. Okay, that definitely wasn't a subway. No. Sounded like explosives. And that sounds like demons. The vault! Hurry! Demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an armory. Or was. There. They blew the locks to get in. Shh. Demons. Stay here. Hell no. It'll take both of us to stop them. And some of these. They're moving. Let's go. Cover! That's what I'm talking about! Just trying to do my part. Look it up! Fire it! Stay clear! Really? Now you're just showing off! Look at Kai dodging. Trucks full of gunmen in one day. It's time to hang up the web. Spider-Man, you demon strap 
much better. These guys are all over the road. They'll kill someone if I can't stop. I'm doing my best to catch up, but you might be on your own. Stay safe, Jeff. Don't do anything crazy. Bystanders will get shot. I gotta get in close. Hey guys, room for one more? Here's your stuff. Now the three decides to run on time. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your angle? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Up in. She's good. Man, I'm beat. Time to head home and get some sleep. All units, mass terrorists have opened fire. Converge on the East Village.
Come on. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's room 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? <sighs> Let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Municipal garage. Bowery and Grand. Not a problem. I don't care if I lose everything else, but I have to find my Spidey drive. Can't be that hard. Finding a tiny flash drive in a 30-ton garbage truck. I have years of research on that drive. Everything I've worked on since high school. it's locked. Can't have people stealing garbage. Maybe there's another way in. It's not really breaking and entering if I don't break anything, right? Okay, no need to panic. Maybe they haven't dumped the trash yet. Nada. Ugh. Okay, time to panic. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Sorry, is there any chance the truck wasn't at the garage? Sure, I guess. Just means it'd be somewhere in West Chinatown. Great, I'm headed there now. Hey, it's a long shot. But sometimes the guys stop for pizza before they drop off. Really? I'll check out the pizza shops. Any idea which one? One of the mom and pop joints, I think. Jerry's? No, that's uptown. I mean, original Jerry's. Oh, right. No, started with an L, I think. Larry's? That's on the east side. Uh, Leo's. Leo's, yeah. Wait, I think I see the trucks. Thanks, Eddie. No worries. Hope you find your stuff. Should be some trucks close by. Nope, stuff's not here. There has to be another truck around here. No sign of my stuff. <coughs> what an interesting smell. See, my only hope. Not there either, huh? You sure they were around here? Well, the guys might have switched routes due to the upcoming Osborne rally. If your pickup was on Route 35, they'd be dropping off at the incinerator right now. Incinerator? Over by Manhattan Bridge. Better hustle. There's the incinerator. Hope I'm not too late. Uh-oh, looks like trouble. Thanks, Spider-Man. You okay? Yeah, thanks. This gang's been terrorizing the whole neighborhood the last couple of days. There's probably more of them on the way. I'll keep an eye out. Hey, mind if I look around for some, uh, some personal items? Sure, have at it. I gotta go file an incident report. There's something there. Gotta move these bags out of the way. 
be here. Yes. Hope it still works. Phew, looks like everything's here. Hey, look, an old gadget prototype. Looks kind of awesome. Why didn't I ever finish it? Uh, I think I can make this work. Got it. Look, it's that guy who fixes Spider-Man. Uh-oh. Ice! Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. Talk my way onto MJ's couch. Let's see. Uh, hi, MJ. It's Peter. Any chance I could stay over to? Oh, that's too far. MJ! I was just in the neighborhood and. Talking again, I thought maybe. Oh, man, that just sounds pathetic. Why am I making this such a big deal? We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just a couch. MJ's couch. Oh, what am I thinking? but I always get the feeling something strange is going on in that place.
Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I wish Harry was in town. I could crash with him. Hmm, someone left me a voicemail. Numbers blocked, though. Hey there, spider. Long time no see. Miss me? Come to this address. Catch me if you can. Uh-oh. I think I know that voice. <laughs> Funny. My fear of heights didn't go away when I got my powers. Had to climb to the top of the Empire State to get over that.
Ryder. Been thinking about you a lot lately. We were good together, weren't we? Maybe it's time to reignite the flame. The Black Cat. Don't tell me she's scoping out places to rob. She promised she would give up that life. What was she looking at? Anything look out of place? She wants me to find something. I need to look harder. There. One of her cats. She packs those with range extenders, then harvests nearby RFID signals. I'll let Yuri know to pick it up. Felicia's too smart to be putting herself at risk like this. She must be desperate for some reason. Better keep an eye out. Hey, Yuri. You still have Black Cat's suit and equipment in the evidence lockup, right? I think so. Why? Is she back at it? Maybe. Just double check and let me know if her gear is still there. Will do. Hey, May. You're calling late. What's up? I thought we were gonna meet up for dinner tonight. Oh, right. I'm sorry, I forgot. It's been a hard day. We lost funding at the lab. Oh, Peter. I'm sorry. I also kind of got evicted from my apartment. What? Do you have a place to stay tonight? Actually, no. Not really. I hate to ask, but any chance you have room at the shelter? Well, of course. Feel free to use the couch in my office. Thanks, May. Break-in in progress. Location is Little Tokyo. Over. Thank you. 
Can't believe I haven't slept since the Fisk takedown. Gotta start taking better care of myself. Hey, kid. What are you doing here at this hour? Just dropping in. Oh, I, uh, had a little mix-up at my apartment. On the street, huh? I know the look. You're in the right place. Nothing to be ashamed of. I know, I just... I hate to take resources from people who need them. Guess what, pal? Right now, you need her. You got a point. Thanks, Gloria. So, I got the job. May's recommendation really helped. People know that when she says something, she means it. Hope May's couch is comfortable. I can't take this. You can, and you will. I'll pay you back... soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor Osborne just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. Wait, isn't Osborne's campaign rally this after- Oh, I see what he's doing. Yeah, we all do. But still, a pretty cool moment for Officer Davis and his family. I'll be there covering it. Wanna join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. Humiliating taking money from May. I should head out into the city and try to pay it forward.
Another message from Doc. Peter, I don't want to change this, but the lead I'm following might not only get the project back on its feet, but also expand it in ways we never could have imagined. Everything happens for a reason, even Norman pulling our plug. Really hope this works out. Doc's work is too important to go unfinished. Jeff, congrats on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed demons gave me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the Fisk construction site in Midtown. Life would kill me if I ditched the ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by, let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. Wait, not Osborne. You know what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> Another camera. Gotta be Black Cat. Are you jealous I'm visiting my other man? I hope so. But you should know bad boys aren't my type. Why are you doing this, Felicia? You know I'm gonna catch you. All units, police are engaged in an active shootout with demons. Officers needed near Tip Bay. Demons are getting bolder. Engaging police in the streets now. Okay, kids. You can't play nice and lose your armor-piercing toys. down. What are they trying to accomplish? Check it out. 
All units 1034. Repeat, assault reported. Officers needed near Turtle Bay. What, it's not fun getting beat up? We'll sit with that for a while. Consolidated shipping. Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. Your boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? I got this. Got what you came for. You don't need to kill us, too. <laughs> Fisk's territory is ours now. Not today. Hey, Willie. You. Nice jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. 
Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Saving bad guys from other bad guys. Not how I thought today would go. Stay here. Wait for the police. on the outside to look for fist men. Gotta find the survivors fast.
Gotta find the survivors fast. Okay? Yeah. Uh, yeah, thanks. Hey, big guy. Fisk, your men are safe. Your turn. Who runs the demons? Maybe he's there. Maybe he isn't. Check the roof. I've missed these cryptic Fisk talks.
Come on. Did that just happen? Yeah. I'm getting reports of a helicopter with a wrecking ball? Yeah, things with the demons got complicated. Sit tight, Yuri. I got this. I know. You need to bring it down. I know. Maybe you can superhero a little faster? Working on it, Yuri. Call you when it's done. Regret this. Hi, is this the flight to Newark? You're playing real fast. I guess this is the plan. Come on, 
Pete, you got this. You got this, you got this, you got this! Please don't screw this up! These masks are so awesome. Where do you get them? We saw this! Cool, thanks! Do they have a website? Yes! Whoops. Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Yo, Miles. Hey, fanboy. Oh, crap. I'm late. You coming? Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All right. Tell your pops I said congrats. MJ, did they start the ceremony yet? They're still setting up. Where are you? Got hung up at work. Be there soon. We have reports of an attack on an armored vehicle. Location is north of Houston. Over. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
civilians in need of assistance following a severe car crash. Please proceed to Bowery. Find the people who caused this. They've still got to be nearby. You're a match, Spider Man. There's the stage entrance, and we'll be right out front. <sighs> Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. The last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. <laughs> well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider-Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> Or, maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so... so? I think this gang war may finally be over. Like, like over, over? Um, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh, instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery. Above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. 
my wife Rio, and my son Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass. I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer. Under there. It was 
right there. I was right there. Gotta help him. Now. We have to leave. Now. Dad. Dad. I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. 
I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were going to say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Or don't worry. It's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry. I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. Jeff. I'm busy. What's up? Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? No. I told you, I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy. Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence. Right. Hey, it's me. Hey. So, what are you thinking? I'm thinking I screwed up. And that kid lost his father. I know you too well to say you should give yourself a break. What about the police? Do they have any leads on Lee? They're not even looking for him. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. You think he's hiding out there? Maybe. We know he's not at Feast. If he's not at the recycling center, maybe you'll find some evidence as to where he might be. Yeah. Good work, MJ. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, one more thing. I talked with a detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, corrupt people. Corrupt? What does that mean? They say it's sort of like mind control. It brings out the negative part of you. It makes you do things you wouldn't normally do. Hmm, sounds a little far-fetched. This is coming from a guy who can run up walls. 